And we are back, ladies and gentlemen, to some more Life is Strange 2. So yeah, just like with Chapter 2 of this game, I'm gonna be giving my reactions to different choices and outcomes for this chapter, for Chapter 3, The Wastelands. Only this time I'm gonna be cutting back on a bit, like, mostly just re showing my reactions to the bigger choices at least, the ones that look like they mattered the most, so... Anything that's in the uh, anything that shows at the end of the chapter by that I mean like the cho many the the many outcomes that the game will show you at the end of each chapter those are the gonna be the ones I'll react to so yeah just a little heads up for that for any future videos from now on but with that said I'll see you next time take care. Man, I'm so fucking tired. Stop your bitching or get out of here. Hey. Jeez. Alright, well, now it's time for me to just sort of stand back and not interfere, see what'll happen. Sir, yes sir. Come on, Sean. We're gonna be late. Right. Okay, I didn't think... Okay, well, I might as well show it anyway, even though it... Didn't really have the reaction I was expecting, because I naturally was expecting Daniel to just sort of like step in, to be honest, you know, in place of Sean. But yeah, I guess it, I guess it makes sense, to be honest, since he was the one that tells us that we won't like, like we wouldn't stand a chance. Sorry about your pup, Hannah. Fuck it, that's life or death, yin and yang, right? Mm. And the uh, floating can is back again. Like, there it is. Sorry, I ruined the mood. Don't worry, hands. We can do work. I'm wiped out. Are you ready for bed yet? I'll go to bed with him. Yep. Yeah, I'm ready to crash too. Let's go. What? No. You're gonna miss our makeover skill. I'll fall asleep. And then you'll turn my ear on. Oh, get out of here. Good night, Finn. Night, night. See, night. Yeah. See you in the morning. You didn't have to come with me, you know? I know. Hey, can we talk about what happened on the lake? Yeah. We can? Okay. That's not a kid anymore. That was wild. Hmm. It kind of bummed me out when you said that you weren't a kid anymore. I mean, I know you're not, but I'm going to miss it. I can't help it, Sean. Things are so different now. I miss my friends, my room, my playbots, everything. It all mm. seems so far away now. I know I'm not always nice with you, but things aren't nice anymore. I know. But don't let this change who you are. I just wish I could have a normal life again. And stop being so angry all the time. I'm just so tired of all this crap. I feel the same way, dude. It's okay. Just... Don't feed the beast, you know? Yeah. You know, I still like it. But hmm. it's kind of tight on me now. Yeah. You're too big for it. I am. But I would like to hear about the Wolf Brothers, if that's okay. Just don't tell the others. Okay? Promise. All right. <clears throat> Get comfy. Oh, are we going to talk about the Wolf Brothers now? Where were we? Um. Oh, yeah. The Wolf Brothers joined a pack of hounds that roamed all over. Finally, the brothers had found new friends. But the little wolf wasn't so sure about the new pack. He didn't want his brother to run away with them. And so the little wolf would howl and prowl, not knowing what was going on. But he didn't know that nothing could ever separate the Wolf Brothers from each other. Ever. Still 
find it hard to take him seriously as a kid, even though he wanted Sean to tell him that story for bedtime, but eh, it is what it is, I guess. I think, yeah, I, yeah, but this is an optional objective, so I'm naturally assuming that this will, oh, yeah, this will, this won't take up anything. Finn. Sean, come on. Oh yeah, I probably should. I'm. I have a feeling there's just gonna be more nudity involved in this scene. Yeah, I, yeah, there is. Well, Ooh, and. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Woo! Yes, well, I'm in. What are you waiting for? Oh, fuck this! It's freezing. <laughs> it's all in your head. Just don't think about it. <laughs> uh, sure. Don't think. Yeah. Uh. <sighs> okay. Here I come. I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Get over it. Hurry up. There I you go. don't know how Let anyone can swim in a lake. Because uh, hey, it's, it's mostly... Take it all off. No cheating. Wait, what? Oh, shit, shit, shit. My, my balls. <sighs> Cassidy, do not even. <clears throat> you are so adorable. Yeah, I know. <laughs> not bad, Diaz. Didn't think you'd actually do it. <laughs> my body just had to. Get used to it. Not that cool. That's because I had to pee. <laughs> <laughs> so, what are you gonna do about Finn and, you know, his plan? Uh, let's see. I talk to him. Uh, yeah, I'm... yeah, let's see what happens now. Because I'm pretty sure she'll get mad at what? it. Are you shitting me? Don't freak out. We can do this. Easy peasy. Easy peasy? What about Daniel? Is this how you fucking protect him? We yeah. can take care of ourselves. Trust me. You know what? I'm done Wait. with Wait! Sean, don't get all mad. Come on. Just listen. I heard your bullshit. You and Finn are so fucking dumb. Flashlight. And, and she took the flashlight too. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, somehow, yeah, I knew there. Was, I knew something. I knew that she would know at some point, which is how she'd get mad, as it was shown in the end of the episode. So I think now is a good time to. There's my partner. Perfect. Been looking all over for your ass. You ready? Did you take a cold shower? What? Uh, kind of. Hey, Sean. You ready to rock? I feel good about this. We just follow the plan, and we're gonna be fucking loaded, guys. Okay, so... How do we get there? We're taking one of Big Joe's trucks. Okay, I think I just figure out how to what to do now. All right, well, I can't. Yeah, I kind of forgot about the back, but I didn't think. I didn't think it was. I, I naturally assumed it was blocked off. So there's that. Okay, so I I, know, I think I know what I have to do now. Now I, now it's all starting to make sense to me. First, I'll just take the screwdriver and nothing else.
serious? Sorry. All right, let's go into the back. Find our way into this truck. Hopefully this won't backfire like uh, other attempts. Score. Hey, Nano. Think you can climb in that back window and open the doors? Let me try. Just be careful and quiet. Oh, please be quiet, hopefully. Okay, I think it looks fine. Sweet. Now let's enter. Oh, we got this. You're good, Diaz. Just hope we didn't wake up the dragon. No stress. Wasn't that loud? And plus, we sabotaged his vehicle, so there's okay. the added benefit of him not following let's do us. This. Uh, that was that was really satisfying now okay so now we can like pretty much like make sure they um, they won't follow us well that big Joe won't follow us and and since we didn't alert him he won't let he won't alert Meryl either so that's good check out that one let me see if there's another way around Oh wait, there is a, another surveillance camera here, and there's more to explore. Check out that one. Boom. Okay, now let's find a way inside. Wait, there's another one here in the back. Shit. That camera is aimed right at us. Boom. Hmm. Okay. There's the safe. Now, we just gotta get inside. I knew there was something about this. No way we can open the door unless we move that shit. Daniel, can you lift up that bar behind the door? Yep. Perfect. You think we'll open that safe easy? Don't worry, little man. Trust me. I know this model. Breakable. Really? Ah, uh, boy. I am ready to just start over again, just in case that that camera, that camera turning red, the lights, the light on that camera turning red didn't mean anything. But who knows? It probably might have. It. <laughs> God, I can't move. Okay. Okay. Hold up. Shh. We sneak in. Daniel opens the safe. We grab the money, then get the fuck out. Sound like a plan? So far, Meryl isn't up now, and he hasn't spotted us, so... <sighs> Alright, this is 
is it, my man? Just focus. Don't rush. Oh, we're already going into that quickly? Alright. No actual gameplay in this place then. At least other than cutscenes, but there. still. That was too loud. Are you okay? We did it. We're rich. God damn it, they're so loud. Daniel. I'm pretty sure little Man, I've never touched this much cash my whole life. Do you realize the things we can do with this money? Thank you. There's a Daniel, gun there. We are a badass team. Ah, it is a major choice. Let's take it, just because... Because we're not going to get a chance to do it anyways. Like in the next playthrough I'm going to do with this game. Or this episode. And there he is! What is this? You have to be shitting me! You losers are actually trying to rip me off? Try not to be so fucking loud! Alright. Move your asses over there. Uh, now. It was a good choice. Uh, <laughs> boss. <laughs> I know this looks bad, <laughs> but stop. I don't want to hear any more of your shit. At least we at least he so, didn't like know beforehand. What was your big fucking plan exactly? Work here for a time and then break into my safe? Pathetic. But yeah, I knew he was going to find Who out eventually. Especially with considering how loud that was. Like I didn't know. I gave you punks work when nobody would. A place to crash for free. This is how you repay me? Stealing from me? Uh, no, no. It's not about you. I thought you were different. Smart. But you're a real dumbass for getting a kid involved. And you're teaching him how to steal? Thief and brother of the year. Nice. What now? You all really fucked up. I can't just let this slide. I can't. You're young, but you can learn from mistakes. That doesn't mean your lesson's gonna be easy. Or painless. Okay. On your knees. Hands on your heads. Don't do this. Don't. Come on, sir. We... We could talk. I'm serious. On your knees. Now. Okay, what can I do? Oh, three options! Perfect! So yeah, there are the two options that would be there by, by, by default if, if we didn't pick up that gun earlier. So, while we have it, let's use it. Daniel, move! Oh! Uh, Motherfucker! Meryl, don't! Ah! Oh god! He got shot! Is he dead? Daniel, don't look. He's... Listen, don't look. Oh boy. No. Okay. No! Okay, so he se seems like he was gonna die anyway. I kind of forgot to be honest well, whether or not he would die or not, if we were quiet enough at least. Because I know he doesn't what? die Daniel. if d if we oh, let Daniel, Daniel use his powers, but then he gets shot too. Yeah, it seems... <laughs> Alright, so let's disagree for this one. Can't. I can't, Finn. No way. Too dangerous for Daniel. <laughs> nah. It's Daniel is the dangerous one. What? Nobody can even touch him. You know it. I said no. I bet you're pissed at us because you didn't get paid. I would be too. I'm so sorry. But... Okay. Okay. No stress, man. I respect your decision. Just wanted to help you. And Daniel. Much love to you guys. Yeah. Sucks. You have to go tomorrow. 
Makes me sad. <laughs> Gonna miss you, Sean. Truly. Thanks, Finn. Same here. If I were you, I would be chilling with Cass. <laughs> this is your last night with her. Don't blow it. You'll be a bitch if you don't say goodbye. Do it for me. All right. Go on. Get back to your party. I'm stoned. Gonna zen out. Damn, Finn. You need to land, man. I'd rather work my ass. Shit. Are we really getting kicked out of this place? We don't have enough money to go down to Mexico. What the fuck are we supposed to do? Stubborn. It's a really stupid idea. Way too dangerous. Oh. Especially for them. I know. Finn acts like this is no big deal. But this feels bad. Plus, I don't want you guys to get in any more trouble. Yeah. Tell that to Daniel. He's gonna be pissed. He's your brother. He'll listen to you. Finn wants to take care of us, but... But he doesn't always see other people. It's all about him. I know. But I feel bad for ruining his dream. He'll rage for a while, for sure. Then I'll be cool. He likes you. What do you mean? Don't worry about it too much. He doesn't. Cool. I just don't want things to get weird between any of us. Ah, uh, no way, Sean. You're too sweet for anyone to get mad at you. Don't get me wet. <laughs> you cracked me up, Sean Diaz. You're so edgy. <laughs> I'd rather be an edgy Mexican than a crazy Texan hillbilly. Oh, he bites back. Shit, I'm gonna miss you, dude. <laughs> Ditto. Pardon? So beautiful. What are you... What are you doing? Look at the sky. Jesus, you're such a hippie. That's why you like me, Sean. Whew. Now I am cold. Let's go. <laughs> Damn, Sean. You really are cold. Shut up. Stop looking. Oh boy. I know where this is going. I just need to swing by my tent so I don't get a head cold. Hey, what's happening? <laughs> oh my goddess. Did you both go swimming? In this weather? Living the dream. <laughs> Did you see Finn? He was with Daniel, but now I can't find him. Well, you didn't see anybody out there. But... Oh. We better go now. Okay, then. Figures Daniel is with him. Just tell Finn I want to talk. Thanks much. Later. Sean, hold up. Wait a sec. Why? We have to stop them. Let's figure out a plan first. We don't have time for that shit. Well, we have to get to Merrill's before then. You're right. Okay, so I guess we're not gonna Maybe get to we that. Can borrow one of Big Joe's trucks. See? So a bit of post-production here, I pretty much lost the footage for my playthrough of when I uh, was stealing the truck from Big Joe and breaking into Merrill's house as Ca with Cassidy on my side, so I've had to like play through the foot play through the gate, play, play through that ga uh, section again, so yeah, my reaction, so I'm not really gonna react surprised or anything if I see anything from this, from this section, just want to give a heads up for that, so. Yeah, enjoy. All right, let's do this again. This is so messed up. What? Oh, I the frame we just dropped there. Fucking Finn. Hey, get mad later. We got shit to do now. 
Alright. If something happens... Fuck me. It's okay. We're gonna get them. Bring them back. Thanks for coming with me, Cassidy. Don't thank me. I'm gonna kill Finn myself. Okay, so I have to do this again, but no problem. Let's skip this. Oh, oh, okay. Not a huge fan of how the frame rate drops every now and then. Oh yeah, we have to check the doors, don't we? Figures. Check the other door now. All right. I need the car then. Oh wait, man! I should have. Uh, God damn it! I should have like seen that cutscene. Nah, never mind. Probably some other time. Although I don't think I'll probably bother at all, to be honest. Considering what we, what does happen. Pick this up. All right. There's nothing else to take. We just need that screwdriver so we can get into the back. Maybe we can get in through here. No way. Um. Might as well skip through this since not much to talk about this cutscene here. Since well, not much to talk about this section here since it's the same thing. If you if you were to like thing, it's the same thing as before. Only difference is that Cassidy is with us and not Guess we won't be Finn or Daniel. What's that? All right. Well, this is an important okay. cutscene. Let's do this. Take it easy, Sean. And again. You did it. Drive. How? How, your guard, Jack, Sean. You're too damn good. how big Joe didn't even hear his own truck driving out there? Just like meter, like uh, several meters, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, away from his house. I don't know, but eh, screw it. This is the quietest, quietest we can get, anyway. <laughs> yeah. Finn is out of control. Has he done this before? Fuck us over? Not like this. Why now? Because Finn thinks Daniel is his golden ticket. He just gets greedy. I'm stupid. We gotta catch him. Wonder if we can go around the back. Well, I mean the side to see the window. Just, I just to don't know if we can ever trust Finn for this shit. I wouldn't. Hannah is gonna go ballistic. Guess you have to tell her too. Hell yeah. She knows how to deal with his ass. Let's deal with this situation first. Alright, well, there's nothing else here, it seems. Um, yeah. Okay, so this is important. Ah, oh, shit! You scared the shit out of me. Good! What the fuck are you doing? Didn't we settle this, man? Shh! You're gonna wake Meryl! Finn? No fucking way. Come on, Sean. Are you kidding me? How could you do that, Finn? And you're so fucking kid. He's nine years old. He asked me for it. I didn't force him, man. Are you an idiot? He's too young to make that kind of decision. Fuck's sake, Finn. He's an old soul. He knows what's up. Mm. Hold on, please. You're standing near a boatload of cash. 
We can do this in five minutes, in and out. And then you're off to Mexico. You won't hear about me ever again. We got this, man. Trust me. My consider actually no like. Means no, Finn. Uh, Meryl is right fucking there. Uh, he's a log. Won't even know. I want to help, Sean. We could get out of here. Go to Mexico. Might consider actually like doing another playthrough of this where I agree to this, but for now I'm just going to disagree, like like I have already. Okay, let's see what happens if I agree to do this. Let's see how Cassidy will react and see <sighs> if that will like thing change Daniel's uh, perception, like change his loyalty okay. to us or something. <clears throat> yes, let's do it. Seriously? Cass, we have to do this. Else we're fucked. Just be your backup. Fuck you, Sean. Don't touch me. Oh, okay then. You're so sick. I can't believe this shit. Okay, well, she leaves us then. That's something. Hey. No stress. She'll cool down when she sees us come back loaded with cash. We don't need her, Sean. We sneak in. Hmm. Daniel opens the safe. We okay. grab the money, then get the fuck out. Okay. Like a plan? What? Really? The, the 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 door wasn't blockaded, like it wasn't locked or anything. Like it wasn't the other playthroughs. What the heck happened? Did they just lift up the beam just to like unlock the door? But if that's the case, then why would Daniel like force the Oh. Oh well, well, well. How the Come on in. How does he know? Alright, move your asses over there, fucking amateurs. Uh Meryl. Now uh, <laughs> okay, well, uh, that's, this was something then. I know Let's... this looks bad, but stop. I don't want to hear any more of your shit. Okay, I think most of this is just going to be the same thing, so might as well end it here. He said like, might as well just to see what will happen Sean? anyway. Please. We're done, Finn. Come on, Daniel. No, why should I? We couldn't even find you before. Mm -hmm. You were with her, right? Who gives a shit? Let's go. Now. No, I'm sick of all this. For weeks, you just hang out with her. It's all your fault. I could do what I want. You're crazy. And the now. What the fuck are you doing here? Shit. Don't move. Don't shoot. What the fuck? How many are you? Just us. It's just us. All right. Move your asses over there. Now, uh, Meryl, uh, <laughs> boss, <laughs> I know this looks bad, but stop. I don't want to hear any more of your shit. So, what was your big fucking plan exactly? Work here for a time and then break into my safe? Pathetic. <laughs> Who was the moron mastermind? Like I didn't know. I gave you punk's work when nobody would. A place to crash for free. God damn it, Finn, I told you- Shut up! This is how you repay me? Stealing from me? No, no, it's not about you. I thought you were different, smart, but you're a real dumbass for getting a kid involved. And you're teaching him how to steal? Thief and brother of the year. Nice. What now? You all really fucked up. I can't just let this slide. I can't. You're young, but you can learn from mistakes. That doesn't mean your lesson's gonna be easy. Or painless. Okay. On your knees. Hands on your head. Shit, don't do this. Don't. Come on, sir. We... We could talk. I'm serious. On your knees. Now. And this I'm going to obey. Although it won't make much of a difference. 
Well, actually, we'll talk says. about that afterwards. Don't worry. We're on our knees, okay? Meryl? No. Finn, just do it! Don't break my balls now, kid. Daniel, you got this. Don't move. Just get on your damn knees! Yeah, now! He can't do this. Don't uh. fucking move! It's not like I want to do this. The people I deal with are worse. But if you rip me off, you rip them off. Then I pay. I have a family to look after too. I gotta protect them first. Can't let you play me anymore. Yeah, I, yeah. So this isn't really gonna make much of a difference if I let him use the power move. because because he's just going to disobey me anyway Please, for boss, some reason. I, know. I got greedy. I, I, I stupid. I, I, I'll make it up. I know, Finn. You will. Oh my god. No. 